Vince Edwards was an American actor and director best known for his starring role as Dr. Ben Casey in the popular 1960s medical drama, Ben Casey. Over a career spanning four decades, Edwards made a name for himself in both television and film, demonstrating his versatile acting skills and establishing himself as a household name. Before his big break on Ben Casey, Edwards got his start in acting on the New York stage, appearing in several Broadway productions. He then made the transition to television and film, landing roles in various productions throughout the 1950s. But it was Ben Casey that catapulted Edwards to stardom. The show, which aired from 1961 to 1966, was a ratings hit and made Edwards one of the most popular actors of the time. His portrayal of the tough, no-nonsense Dr. Casey resonated with audiences and cemented his place in television history. After Ben Casey, Edwards continued to work in both television and film, appearing in numerous productions over the years. He also turned his hand to directing, helming several episodes of Ben Casey as well as other TV shows and made-for-TV movies. Throughout his career, Edwards received critical acclaim for his acting skills and was known for his dedication to his craft. His work has left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry and continues to be celebrated by audiences and industry professionals alike. Vince Edwards was a well-known actor, famous for his roles in movies and TV shows from the 1950s to the 1970s. You might recognize him from his starring role in the medical drama Ben Casey. Did you know that Vince Edwards directed some of the episodes of Ben Casey and even sang the theme song? We're excited to share some fun, surprising, and even emotional facts about Vince Edwards' life and career. We'd love to hear from you. Do you have a favorite Vince Edwards moment that has stuck with you? Or perhaps a memory of the first time you saw him on screen? Please share your stories and memories in the comments below. We can't wait to read them. And stay tuned to learn more about this classic star. There are many interesting facts coming up, so don't go anywhere. Vince Edwards, born Vincent Edwards Oino in Brooklyn, New York, in 1928, had a diverse upbringing that influenced his successful acting career. His father, Frank Zoino, was a bricklayer, while his mother, Catherine O'Hare, was a housewife. Edwards was the eldest of three children, with a sister, Kathy, and a brother, Robert. As a child, Edwards was exposed to various cultural experiences through his mother, who loved movies and theater. She often took him to see Broadway shows and films, sparking his interest in acting. Edwards' natural talent for performing became evident in his early years when he sang in the church choir and participated in school plays. During his teenage years, Edwards attended Thomas Jefferson High School in Brooklyn, where he excelled in sports and continued to pursue his passion for acting. He was inspired by his drama teacher, Boris Goldovsky, who recognized his potential and encouraged him to pursue a career in the arts. After high school, Edwards studied drama at the prestigious actor studio in New York City, where he honed his craft under the guidance of renowned acting coach Lee Strasberg. Strasberg's method acting technique had a profound impact on Edwards, shaping his approach to character development and scene work. Throughout his career, Edwards credited Strasberg, Goldovsky, and his mother as his key influences and mentors. Their support and guidance played a crucial role in his successful journey in the world of acting. Vince Edwards was an American actor, best known for his role as Ben Casey in the medical drama series of the same name, which aired from 1961 to 1966. During his era, Edwards had a significant influence on the film industry, particularly in television. His portrayal of the intense, dedicated, and sometimes troubled neurosurgeon, Ben Casey, left a lasting impression on audiences and helped to shape the medical drama genre. Edwards' impact extended beyond his acting abilities. He directed several episodes of Ben Casey, showcasing his versatility and contributing to the show's success. This marked one of the earliest examples of an actor also serving as a director for a TV series, helping to pave the way for future actor-directors. After Ben Casey, Edwards continued to act in films, television movies, and series throughout the 1960s, 70s, and 80s. His work in the industry contributed to the evolving landscape of Hollywood, demonstrating the versatility and depth that television and film could offer. Vince Edwards' career is a testament to the power of an actor's influence in shaping the entertainment industry. His contributions to Hollywood continue to be felt and appreciated, even today. Vince Edwards, born Max Edwards, 
was a young boy when he discovered his passion for acting. Growing up in Brooklyn, New York, he was an athletic and outgoing child who loved being the center of attention. One day, while participating in a school play, he found himself captivated by the magic of the stage. He was only 10 years old, but he knew then that he wanted to become an actor. Edward's parents recognized his talent and encouraged him to pursue his dream. They enrolled him in acting classes and he quickly excelled. He began performing in local theater productions and his natural charisma and talent for acting drew the attention of casting directors. At the age of 17, Edwards landed his first professional acting job in a touring production of Tea and Sympathy. He continued to work in theater, eventually making his way to Broadway. In the early 1950s, he began appearing in television shows and movies and his career took off. Throughout his career, Edwards remained passionate about acting. He once said, acting is not just a job for me. It's a way of life. It's who I am. His dedication to his craft was evident in every performance, and he left a lasting impact on the world of entertainment. Despite facing many challenges throughout his career, including struggles with alcoholism and health issues, Edwards never lost his love for acting. He continued to work in the industry until his death in 1996, leaving behind a legacy as a talented and dedicated actor. In conclusion, Vince Edwards discovered his passion for acting at a young age, and he pursued that passion with determination and dedication throughout his life. His talent and charisma made him a beloved figure in the world of entertainment, and his legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors today. Vince Edwards, known for his role as Dr. Ben Casey, faced challenges during the production of Hammerhead when he broke his heel bone, causing most of his standing, walking, and running scenes to be completed by his double. In the TV show Ben Casey, tensions arose between Edwards and co-star Sam Jaff, resulting in Jaff's departure. Even guest star Sammy Davis Jr. and director Jerry Lewis had conflicts with Edwards. Edwards, an alumnus of the American Academy of Dramatic Arts, class of 1950, had a successful career despite these challenges. His performance as Dr. Ben Casey remains a significant part of television history despite the issues that arose during production. Vince Edwards, an accomplished actor, faced significant challenges in his early career. Despite growing up in poverty and struggling financially, he was determined to succeed in the acting industry. To make ends meet, he worked various jobs, including as a hospital orderly and a bartender while pursuing his passion for acting. Edwards' talent and determination caught the attention of industry professionals, but he still encountered skepticism. Some critics doubted his ability to break away from his early roles and worried that he was too typecast. However, Edwards refused to let this discourage him. Instead, he took matters into his own hands and began writing and producing his own projects. This allowed him to showcase his versatility and creativity, ultimately silencing his critics and solidifying his place in the industry. Despite facing numerous obstacles, Vince Edwards remained resilient and dedicated to his craft. His ability to find creative solutions and continue pushing forward in the face of adversity is a true testament to his character and his enduring legacy in the world of acting. Vince Edwards was a favorite actor of Bo Jackson's mother, who named her son after him. Edwards was best known for his role as Dr. Ben Casey in the popular 1960s medical drama, Ben Casey. However, his time on set was not without controversy. According to director Mark Rydell, Edwards had a gambling problem which often disrupted filming. He would demand to film all of his scenes first so he could leave the set and go to the racetrack. His castmates also claimed that he would constantly ask them for money to support his gambling habit, often leaving the set for hours at a time. Despite these challenges, Edwards' career was launched with the help of Bing Crosby, whose production company made Ben Casey. Vince Edwards' career had several breakthrough moments that highlighted his acting abilities and versatility. In 1955, he landed a significant role in the film The Brave One, where his performance was praised by critics and peers alike. Noted film critic Bosley Crowther commended Edwards' impressive portrayal of a ranch hand, which marked a notable beginning for the actor's career. Another career-defining moment for Edwards was his lead role as Ben Casey, a neurosurgeon, in the television series Ben Casey. The show became a massive hit and garnered critical acclaim for its realistic and gritty depiction of the medical field. 
Co-star Tony Roberts commented that Vince brought a certain intensity and charisma to the role that really resonated with audiences. Edwards' performance in Ben Casey also caught the attention of director Blake Edwards, who cast him in the film The Great Race. Working alongside Hollywood legends like Tony Curtis and Jack Lemmon, Vince held his own and delivered a memorable performance. According to Blake Edwards, Vince brought a depth and intensity that was essential to the character and the film. In the late 1960s and 1970s, Vince continued to challenge himself with diverse roles in films and television shows. In the miniseries Washington Behind Closed Doors, he played a powerful and corrupt senator earning praise for his nuanced performance. Vince brought a sense of gravitas and complexity to the character that made him both compelling and detestable, said director Daniel Petrie. Throughout his career, Vince Edwards proved himself to be a talented and adaptable actor. His breakthrough moments in The Brave One, Ben Casey, The Great Race, and Washington Behind Closed Doors solidified his status in the industry and left an indelible mark on audiences and critics alike. Vince Edwards, an actor well known for his roles in film and television, had a twin brother named Bob Zoino. Edwards' career began with his debut in the 1947 film Dark Passage, where he played a cop at a toll booth. One of Edwards' notable roles was as Major Cliff Bricker in the 1968 film The Devil's Brigade. During a 30-mile hike in the movie, Major Bricker, played by Edwards, instructed the U.S. troops to shape up and maintain their distance, interval, and alignment while using a marching maneuver called route step. This type of marching allows soldiers to talk and is often used when crossing bridges to avoid sympathetic vibrations that could lead to their collapse. Vince Edwards was an actor known for his work in film, television, and theater. His artistic vision was shaped by his experiences and worldview, which were reflected in his work. Edwards approached his work with a unique style that combined naturalism and intensity. He had the ability to fully inhabit a character, making them feel real and relatable to audiences. He was known for his versatility, able to play a wide range of roles with equal skill and commitment. One of the things that made Edwards' approach to acting unique was his attention to detail. He would spend hours researching a role, studying the character's background, motivations, and personality. This allowed him to bring a deep level of authenticity to his performances. Edwards' personal experiences and worldview were also reflected in his work. He was born and raised in Brooklyn, New York, and many of his early roles drew on his experiences growing up in a working-class neighborhood. He was also deeply committed to social justice, and his work often explored issues of inequality and injustice. Despite his success, Edwards remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He continued to act and direct throughout his career, always striving to push himself and explore new challenges. His legacy as an actor is one of authenticity, intensity, and commitment to his art. Vince Edwards, known for his role in the medical drama Ben Casey, was also a talented singer. At the height of his TV fame, he released several albums for Decca Records, with the first one, Vincent Edwards Sings, becoming a hit. In addition to his work on Ben Casey, Edwards had a role in the film Mr. Universe, where he acted alongside Harry Landers, his co-star from Ben Casey. Despite being offered the part of the doctor in the comedy film Airplane, in 1980, Edwards turned it down. These facts highlight Edwards' diverse career and his impact on both television and music. Vince Edwards was a significant figure in the acting industry, particularly known for his role in the medical drama Ben Casey. His portrayal of the title character had a profound impact on how medical professionals were depicted on television. According to Robert Thompson, a professor of television and popular culture at Syracuse University, Vince Edwards and Ben Casey helped to establish the idea of the intense, caring, and somewhat troubled doctor as a leading character on television. Edwards' influence extended beyond his on-screen persona. He directed several episodes of Ben Casey, showcasing his versatility and contributing to the evolution of television storytelling. His directorial work was praised for its innovative visual style and complex character development. Edwards' co-star, Sam Jaff, who played the role of Dr. Zorba on Ben Casey, spoke highly of Edwards' talent and dedication. He once said, Vince was a consummate professional. He brought a depth and authenticity to his role that was truly inspiring. Edwards' impact can also be seen in the trends that followed Ben Casey. 
The intense, character-driven medical dramas that are common today can trace their roots back to Edward's groundbreaking performance. His influence can be seen in shows like Er, Grey's Anatomy, and The Good Doctor. In addition, Edward's work paved the way for future actors to take on complex and challenging roles. His ability to balance the demanding schedule of an actor-director served as a testament to the possibilities of a career in the entertainment industry. As Thompson puts it, Vince Edwards showed that actors could be more than just pretty faces. They could be artists, storytellers, and leaders in their field. In conclusion, Vince Edwards' contribution to the acting industry is significant and enduring. His portrayal of Ben Casey revolutionized the way medical professionals were depicted on television, and his work as a director helped to shape the future of television storytelling. His influence can still be seen in the trends and techniques of today's entertainment industry, making him a truly influential figure in the world of television. Vince Edwards, an American actor, passed away after a month-long battle with pancreatic cancer. He died on March 11, 1996, at the UCLA Medical Center in Los Angeles, where he had been hospitalized for 11 days. Edwards was best known for his role as Dr. Ben Casey in the popular 1960s medical drama, Ben Casey. The show, which aired from 1961 to 1966, was a hit and made Edwards a household name. Throughout his career, Edwards appeared in numerous films and television shows. His film credits include The Brotherhood, The Perfect Furlough, and House of Women. On television, he had recurring roles in Matt Houston, Hawaii Five-0, and Mission Impossible. Edwards was not only an actor, but also a singer, director, and writer. He released several albums and even performed at Carnegie Hall in New York City. As a director, he worked on episodes of Ben Casey and Matt Houston. He also wrote and directed the 1972 film The Man. Despite his success, Edwards' personal life was marked by controversy and legal issues. He was married three times and had several high-profile relationships. He also faced multiple lawsuits, including a wrongful death lawsuit filed by the family of a man who died during the filming of The Brotherhood. Edward's passing was a loss for the entertainment industry, as he left behind a legacy of memorable performances and contributions to film and television. He was 67 years old at the time of his death. Vince Edwards, an accomplished actor, had a rich personal life that informed his work and values. He was a family man who cherished his time with his loved ones. Despite his busy acting schedule, he always made time for his wife and children, considering them his top priority. Edwards was also a passionate supporter of various charitable causes. He was particularly involved in efforts to support children with special needs and was an active member of the Muscular Dystrophy Association. He often used his platform to raise awareness for the organization and participated in various fundraising events. In addition to his philanthropic work, Edwards had a deep love for music and often incorporated it into his acting projects. He was a talented singer and played the guitar, often performing at charity events and on television shows. Edwards' personal values and interests were reflected in his work as an actor. He was known for taking on roles that highlighted the human condition and explored complex themes such as love, loss, and redemption. His ability to connect with audiences on a deep level was a testament to his talent and dedication to his craft. Despite his many accomplishments, Edwards remained humble and dedicated to giving back to his community. He was a true role model and his legacy continues to inspire and impact those who knew him and those who continue to enjoy his work. Vince Edwards faced a significant tragedy in his personal life when his daughter, Amanda, was diagnosed with cystic fibrosis. Amanda's illness deeply affected Edwards, and he became a prominent advocate for cystic fibrosis research and treatment. Sadly, Amanda passed away at the young age of 16, which left a profound and lasting impact on Edwards. In his honor, Edwards established the Amanda Foundation, a nonprofit organization dedicated to helping animals in need, particularly those with special needs or those in kill shelters. The foundation has saved thousands of animals since its inception, and it continues to operate today. This tragic event and Edward's response to it serve as a testament to his character and his commitment to making a positive impact in the world. Vince Edwards left a lasting impact on the acting industry with his diverse and compelling performances. His work in television shows like Ben Casey showcased his talent and versatility. 
He paved the way for future actors by demonstrating the importance of authenticity and dedication in one's craft. For those aspiring to make their mark in acting, Edwards would likely advise them to stay true to themselves and their artistic vision. He might encourage them to explore different roles and genres to expand their range and versatility. Furthermore, he would likely emphasize the value of continuous learning and improvement, as well as the importance of building a strong work ethic. In terms of his own future contributions, even though Vince Edwards is no longer with us, his work continues to inspire and influence new generations of actors. By studying his performances and learning from his approach to acting, aspiring professionals can carry on his legacy and make their own unique contributions to the industry. In summary, Vince Edwards' legacy in the acting industry is a testament to his talent, versatility, and dedication. For those looking to follow in his footsteps, his advice would likely be to stay true to oneself, continually learn and improve, and build a strong work ethic. His impact on the industry lives on, and future generations can carry on his legacy by building upon his contributions and making their own unique mark. Let's take a moment to talk about Vince Edwards, a remarkable actor who left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. If you've seen his work, we'd love to hear your thoughts on his performances in the comments below. Edwards was best known for his role as Dr. Ben Casey in the popular 1960s medical drama of the same name. His portrayal of the dedicated and sometimes troubled surgeon captivated audiences and solidified his place in television history. Beyond his work on Dr. Ben Casey, Edwards had a diverse career, appearing in films, television shows, and even directing a few movies himself. His talent and versatility were truly impressive, and his creative spirit continues to resonate in the world of entertainment. So, whether you're a longtime fan of Vince Edwards or are just discovering his work, we invite you to share your thoughts and feelings about his contributions to the entertainment industry. If you enjoy our content, please remember to like, and share our posts and consider subscribing to our channel for more great content celebrating the creators who've shaped the entertainment we love. Together, let's take a moment to appreciate the enduring legacy of Vince Edwards and the many other talented actors and filmmakers who have enriched our lives through their work.